Hey guys, I got a new video for you today and we're going to be taking a look at a new pair of Oakley sunglasses that I just received. Um, I actually took advantage of some of the deals that Standard Issue was having um, on some of their eyewear and picked up this model here. I actually had it on my radar. Um, I, I'm not a big fan of metal frames, but this particular one, I kind of like the way they look. So I actually went to the store, tried them on. Um, because I knew this particular color in this model was only available through standard issue. So uh, I liked the way they looked in the store. So I went ahead and got on standard issue and I picked them up and I got them in today. So I'll go ahead and show them to you guys. This is the Oakley Contrail. As you guys can see right there, this particular one, again, being in the satin gold frame with the prism black lenses. This is only available on standard issue right now. Hopefully uh, they will start carrying this particular color in the stores because I think it is a great example of what this um, actual model is modeled after. So if you guys are not familiar with the Contrail, uh, basically the Contrail is a modern take on the classic pilot sunglasses. And I think this color here, the gold frame with the prism black lenses is the best example of that. I know some, a lot of people tend to think and, and associate the kind of silver frame with the black lenses with more of the pilot ones, but when I think of the pilot sunglasses, the quintessential pilot sunglasses, it is the gold frame. So that's why I wanted to go ahead and pick them up. So let's go ahead and open up the box right here. Now, um, this particular frame, the Contrail frame, is available in both the, um, the standard frame, which is this one here. When I say standard, I mean the C5 alloy frame. So it's the, um, the, the metal frame, but I believe they recently got released in a titanium frame as well. So uh, even though these are already pretty lightweight, I, I haven't had uh, any experience with the titanium frame on this model yet, but I venture to guess that they are gonna be pretty light also. So again, this one is the, um, the gold color. So again, let me look at the box so I can get the exact name, the satin gold. So it's not going to be a really shiny gold. It's not like a polished gold. Um, and it's not a matte. It's kind of in between the two colors. And then obviously the prism black lenses. And I'm so glad they went with prism black as opposed to um, prism gray or something like that, just because the black is going to um, be a little bit darker and it's going to hide your eyes, which I know a lot of times I get questions on that. Um, um, which lenses will be able to hide my eyes, the prism black will do a better job than the gray will. So as you see there on the lenses, on this side, you do have a little sticker that tells you that it is not polarized, but it is prescription ready. And then on the other side, letting you know that it is a prism lens. So let's go ahead and take these off. I will very carefully peel them off there. And then the one on the other side here. All right, and I will take the plastic off of the stem there. Let me go ahead and uh, remove any fingerprints I might have left when I was taking those off. And there we go. Now, um, the other really cool thing that I liked about these is that it wasn't a complete um, circle or, or, or completely round. And I, I hope I'm making sense in that. There is some sort of angles to the bottom right here. And um, I like that. It, it gives it a teardrop um, kind of look to the lens itself, but it gives it a little bit more character too with these, um, these kind of sharper corners right there. I really like the way those look. Obviously you have the double nose bridge there which is very reminiscent of the classic pilot sunglasses and then on the bottom here you do have the word prism etched into the lens right there as you come across the side right here uh, uh, you have the really thin stems and this one having um, you know in order to match the black the prism black lenses you do have a black icon the icon is actually recessed into the frame so it's actually like a part of the frame right there and then it's very thin when you get to this area and then it kind of thickens out a little bit more as you get to the back part here where the unobtainium is right there. So that is good because again, um, this is uh, unobtainium rubber that when you sweat, it'll actually bond a little bit more to your skin, which will um, allow for the frame to actually, st to actually stay in place. These do have spring hinges, which I feel is almost a must when it, with any type of wireframes. I um, will be very 
uh, wary of a frame that is not spring hinge. It's uh, at least for me, just because I prefer the way those fit. And then you have you do have the rubber nose pieces right here. These are adjustable, so you can push them out or push them in, so you can get a better fit on the frame themselves. So I think for the most part, this is a great representation of again that classic pilot sunglasses in the uh, kind of more modern looking frame here with the contrails. Um, it just looks really, really awesome. So um, let me go ahead and, oh, actually, before I do that, let me show you right inside here. You do have the model. It's um, stamped right on the inside of the frame right there. So it does say contrail. So again, uh, let me go ahead and turn the camera around. I will put these on so you guys can see what they look like on me. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and take a look at the contrail here. Again, this is the satin gold with the prism black lenses. So as I already mentioned, the spring hinges makes a big difference when you go to put these on just because they kind of flare out a little bit. It makes it more comfortable. It's not as tight, especially if you have a smaller frame face um, or a larger frame face, you know, they'll, they'll accommodate to, to what it is. So as you guys can see, this is a really awesome example. It, it's, it's a very timeless look, that, that kind of classic pilot, classic aviator look. It's very timeless. Um, it reminds me of, you know, the 80s with Tom, Tom Cruise wearing, you know, wearing them during Top Gun and things like that, or any other movies where you see pilots wearing their, their kind of um you know aviators or their pilot sunglasses and i really really like the way these look now obviously these being more of a lifestyle frame you're not going to have a, a, a lot of wrap to them so they're not going to wrap too much so you will have some space on the side right here again these are lifestyle glasses so they're great to wear like while you're driving as you're walking around and things like that but don't expect too much um, blockage of the side uh, of the from the sides of the sun or light or anything like that but straight on light they look really good um, they do a really awesome job at blocking out the glare and the sun and stuff like that pretty reflective as you can see here with the lights coming off of the camera there very very thin on the sides with the uh, with the stems being really thin which i do like it makes it a lot more comfortable um, a lot more lightweight so if you're going to have them on for a long time for a prolonged amount of time maybe you, you know you're going for a long drive or something like that they're going to be very very comfortable now as always i do like to take my glasses off and kind of put them on top of my head here this is is what I would normally do if I walk into an area uh, maybe inside somewhere a house or in the mall or something like that that I'm not gonna have my glasses on this is normally how I would be wearing them and then once I go back outside I just kind of bring them back down and they are good to go so again really really awesome pair here uh, as I mentioned this particular color the satin gold with the prism black is a standard issue exclusive unfortunately it's not available on the site or on the regular site or on the stores so hopefully it will be available sometime soon um, because I think this color is really, really nice. And again, one of the better representations of that kind of classic pilot sunglasses, um, at least in my opinion. But if not, these are available in a bunch of other colors. I do have another color in mind that I might want to pick up. Um, if it goes on sale or something like that, I might pick it up as well, just because I really like the combination um, uh, of some of the other models that they do have available in this particular model, uh, which is the Contrail. So there it is. Uh, just a quick look at this one because I think it's a little bit different than some of the other ones that I have been showcasing lately. I don't gravitate too much towards um, metal frames, C5 alloy, things like that. But once in a while, I do find one that I like and um, I want to go ahead and show, you, show it to you guys because again, um, I think it, it would be good to see it if you guys are on the fence about picking one up or not. So again, this is the Contrail model in the satin gold uh, frame with the prism black lenses. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.